Well, here's a look at our rain for the upcoming weekend. It will be a soaker, and we'll talk to you all about it. It's meteorologist Joe Martucci here. Good to be with you. We are looking for one to two inches of rain along the I-5 corridor, and then we are going for two and a half to four inches of rain along the beaches here. Now, let's take a look at our future cast, and you see that soaking rain as we go into the overnight hours Friday night. And really last all the way until Saturday morning here. Then we'll get a break mid to late morning with just some scattered showers throughout the day. And then wait for it. Here comes another round of some steady rain for your Saturday evening. Then by about midnight or so, we do get some steadier showers to come into the region. But then it's gone as we get into our Sunday morning, which should be an increasingly bright day. But then here comes some more rain as we go into our Monday. Here's a look at our snow cover. Not really all that much for us here. There will be some snow once you get into Washington above 8,000 feet, but otherwise this is pretty much a rainmaker for us here across the region. Here's a look at our low temperatures tonight. It's a mild night out there in the 40s in a number of spots. And then we're talking about temperatures in the 50s in Long Beach, Corvallis, and Newport. We go to Saturday here, highs generally in the 50s see Yakima in the 40s, but along that I-5 corridor, mild for your Sunday. Temperatures well above average in the low to mid-60s. There will be some gusts as we go into the weekend, 30 miles an hour along the beaches, but for the valleys here, generally the gusts will be light as we go into Saturday. 25 miles an hour isn't all that significant here, and even into Sunday, wind's actually even lighter across the area so to recap this weekend's weather we are talking about landslides possible where there's already been tree damage because of the rain we're expected to see small streams and creeks may flood but we're not talking about a significant widespread flooding event for us here and we have our heaviest rain friday night as well as saturday night for more from me and our lee weather team you can check out our across the sky podcast we have a new episode for you on monday where we're going to talk to you about drones and weather be sure to check that out you can find it wherever you get your podcasts